The Files application from Google was first released as part of a more slimmed down version of its mobile operating system called Android Go. It has since been renamed, launched globally, and has amassed a fan base within the community thanks to its clean design, easy to use features, and fast response time. But even after it had been included in the full version of Android, some smartphone OEMs refused to include an app icon for it. So today, I want to show you an application called Files Shortcut that is free to download in the Google Play Store, and it allows us to launch the Files application just like any other app that's currently installed. To find it, you'll want to open up the Google Play Store and then do a search for Files Shortcut. You should see a result from a development team called Delta 8 Studio. And while it should be free to install, it doesn't actually install any applications to our smartphone or tablet since the Files app has been built into the Android operating system for years now. This app only creates an app shortcut for the Files application to make it much easier to access. Now I have the Redmi Note 12 here and these devices from Chinese OEMs are a great example of ones where the company has added their own file manager app. So you can see we do not have the files by Google app icon here, even though it's built into the operating system. So once we go and install this files shortcut app, and then we check our app drawer, we can see a new app icon for the files application. Now, sadly, we cannot easily uninstall the default file manager application without root access, but we can hide it so that it won't look like we have two file manager applications installed. And while this may work on most modern smartphones and tablets with Android, the developer cannot guarantee that it will work on all devices. So if you install this files shortcut application from the Play Store and you don't end up seeing the files app icon in your app drawer, then it likely means the app is not built into your firmware. This could mean that the phone is too old and just hasn't received that update, but it could also mean that the OEM or wireless carrier has manually removed it from the firmware before releasing it to their customers. Still, installing this free app is a quick and easy way to find out if you have a built-in file manager application which can help to keep your device clean from having to install a third-party alternative. 